You seem so, and I noticed this when you were here for Cleopatra, you seem so at ease in being immersed in the past. I mean, which is obviously a quality that biographers- Are you saying I don't have a life? <laughs> well, <laughs> I'm wondering. You, you know, would I, be right. I'm kind of interested in, in your own character development and how that happens. I'm afraid it might um, be an occupational hazard for those of us who are not hugely interested in ourselves. Really? <laughs> it, may, it may come in handy in the writing of biography that you um, particularly like to inhabit someone else's life or you prefer to inhabit, maybe that make, can sound a little parasitic in a way, that you <laughs> prefer to inhabit someone else's life to your own. Um, there's definitely, I think there's something there. I just. It's not just empathy, it's also this wholesale um, dislocation that you're, you're wholesale moving to someone else's time and place. Right, I mean, it, the distance seems to be something that... I think I, have a, I might just be a premature nostalgic or something. <laughs> you <know? laughs> what do you mean by that? I mean, I'm always longing for the lost world. Um, you can't spend a lot of time in um, Hellenistic Alexandria without wishing you lived there. Right. So I, 17th century Massachusetts, I, I take is not necessarily as appealing an address. Um, but there is something in, 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 that, in that particular extract, the, 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 the silence, the eerie silence. Um, and the dark were something that I really um, were so just striking and utterly fascinating to me. You have you have people in court talking about how they are ear witnesses to things. That sense that sound and words were primary, um, which of course had something to do with getting all your news from the pulpit. Um, but it, it, it was such a completely. It was an idea to which I was so unused and which I found to be so fascinating. So, I don't know, call it what you will, escapism of a, yeah. of a kind, professional escapism.